thinking of maybe do, I say do it. I'm encouraging them. Do it. Don't leave it till you're 40. Because I, I sometimes I just feel too old. Say that. I, I mean, I agree with you because I had Bo when I was 35, and and I and I don't think we can have it all. And I did work hard and then put babies on the back burner for a while. And I wanted more children. And actually, biological mm. clock d determined that I couldn't. But I have to say, I mean, in in defence of younger women, I've got a mate who had a child when she was 16, and she's a phenomenal parent. She was a phenomenal parent then. She is now. She's now in her 20s, and her son is a really well balanced child. She's less flappy than I am. When I Did when she I have her, own, then, Lisa? yeah, she was on her own. She Completely. was a single no parent. No help from her parents. Well, yeah, of course she had help from well, her parents. I mean, everybody, you have to rely on the resources that you have, and it, whether it's a p parent or a friend or somebody, every you know, you can get people to rally for you. But I have to say, in her her personality and her maturity, it was all there. And me, I was 35, I had bow, I was hot, like those helicopter parents they talk about, flapping over the kid going, do you want this? Well, can I get you that? Oh, she's breathing funny, she's looking funny. You know, I was like, I didn't really, I wasn't calm, even though I was a much older parent. So I do think it, it depends on the individual. Exactly. But it depends on the circumstances as well, doesn't mm -hmm. it? I mean, I, I had Keely at 33 and I, I, I was the breakfast.